What is up guys, this is Warner Gamer Phone 4 here and today I'm going to be talking about the new COD, as you guys know, Black Ops 3, and this is just going to be a little bit of my thoughts on what's going on, what I think, and if I'm going to buy it. So, stay tuned and here are my thoughts. So, let's get right to it. Um, At first, this was exactly what I was thinking. I was thinking, okay, I hate COD now, I don't like EXOs, it just... I know, as you guys can see, I do use it because that is the point, like, I have to use it. It is in the game, but I highly dislike it. It's just, ah, uh, it's just, I don't even know how to explain it. It's just, and I say it's just, but anyways, um, and it was just like, uh, the trailer, and it was talking about, like, the numbers and everything, and I was like, okay, it's Black Ops. I was like, I was hoping that they don't add them, and then they gave us a story trailer, and that is where... I got happy because that is where it showed no exos. There was like this um like they jumped up high, but it's long. It's not like the exo boost, the exo jump and the exo dash and all that bull crap. I'll be fine with it. It looked pretty cool. Like the only thing I can see, but it wasn't even a problem that part um there was a part which there will be a link of the trailer. Um it's like this part where he like his hand like turns into this like mini gun type thing starts blasting people. There was also a part where they were in the water and shooting. I um someone in the video I was watching they also were hoping that you could do that multiplayer, which would be that'd be so cool. Like if they just had a map kinda like desired for that, like you could just go into the water. It's like mainly where the battleground would be. That was just uh what I was thinking. Also, what got me the hype the most was there's a bow. And yes, you're just like, you're probably thinking like, what a bow? Why would you want a bow in the future? Well, it just means it looks so cool, and I wonder what they would do with it, because COD has never added a bow. And it sounds stupid of me getting hyped off of it, but I don't know why. It's just so cool, because like, just, oh, uh, I don't, oh man, I got so hyped when I saw that. Um, also, here is a prediction. So, I was seeing like, some gameplay on the trailer, and I don't know if it was multiplayer, but... There was, like, there was the humans, and then there were some robots, so, like, maybe, just maybe, there was, like, robots versus humans, which would be kind of cool, but, like, oh, wait, actually, that'd be kind of cool, actually, like, if you could customize a robot, that'd be awesome, but I don't know exactly, they haven't released too much, also, who I watch was saying something about, uh, what you call it? the customization like you can change your gun camo and oh my god that's so cool like they got me more hyped in that story story trailer than i expected multiplayer seems like it'd be fun i mean they had the crust with the score the score streaks which there's this like one that comes out of your hand or something it's like a bunch of like bugs or something but it looks cool multiplayer doesn't look that bad it looks pretty fun i don't know exactly what's going to turn out but it looks pretty fun to me also story um it's just like the same as Black Ops 2, but like continuing it on to Black Ops 3, which is fine. But I hope it's not exactly the same, because if it's exactly the same, I'm going to be a little disappointed. Like, oh, it's you can't do anything because the future, man, the future. Like, add something in there to make it more fun. Don't make it just like, all right, shoot this guy. He, he took over your XO, like in Advanced Warfare. And yeah, that's pretty much it. Which, I, I don't know, just, they need to make it good. I'm hoping they will make the story good. I mean, they done screwed up on Advanced Warfare. Kevin Spacey helped him. That's, like, literally the only reason why I actually was amused with story mode. Because I was like, hey, look, this guy's actually good at acting. And I think that's about it. Um, For multiplayer, oh, I almost forgot, zombies. Ah, oh, man. You don't have to pay for it. Why did Advanced Warfare make you pay for it? The zombies, that's so stupid. I learned, okay, I did buy it, but only the first one. I was like, I'm not buying another one. That's stupid. Why are they going to make you pay for zombies? They're having it. And I got so hyped. They only showed a little bit of it. I also, from the person I watched, said, well, I don't know if this is correct, so don't, like, don't hold me on this, but there may actually be like a story to zombies, which people have been asking for. I've been asking for it, and oh my god, if they did. Black Ops 3 would be so much better. I would love that. I would be playing zombies like all day. I'd be playing multiple. Like it just seems like so much fun. I mean, you got that bow. You got your hand that like turns into like a mini gun thing. And that may be a score streak actually. Um, I do wonder which is not like 
big, big, but like, I wonder what they do with what they are going to do with um, the thermal. I don't think that's going to be in it, because in that trailer it showed, uh, not the world review, reveal, not review, it like, the guy didn't have like no legs or something, and I didn't really understand that, so I got a little confused, but hopefully they don't have it anyways, because that'd be kind of weird. Well, I mean, they might. They might, I'm trying to think. Yeah, I could see. Maybe, just maybe they could have it like for their top part or something. You now have oh, yeah, sorry about that, guys. I had to make a new clip, but, anyways, I think that is about it. Zombies, I'm hyped for. Multiplayer looks pretty fun. That score streak looks like a big, like, spider looking thing. Campaign, I don't know too much about. They just said, oh, it's the technology taking over again. So I'm kind of iffy. But maybe they can surprise us. I mean, it's Black Ops. I've loved both of them. And I may... I, Black Ops 2 was the only ever COD I spent $50 on. And it was completely worth it. The DLC was fun to me. Advanced Warfare... Eh. The second one was looks better than the first one. But I'm not buying any more for it. It's not worth it. But Black Ops 3... It may just be different. I'm still thinking about it. But I think that's about it, guys. I hope you enjoyed. Make sure you'll check out Mr. Felix Burns' um, discussion on this. It should already be up. Uh, his link will be in the description below. And um, also the uh, world review reveal. And then there'll be the uh, other one, which I, I don't know. It was like a, a teaser or something. Well, like I said, hope you guys enjoyed. Make sure to smash that like button and subscribe. And I'll see you guys in the next video.